How's it going guys, it's GemFan777 here, and this is FanDuel Nothing to Riches, Episode 9. Now, I haven't done an episode of FanDuel Nothing to Riches in a while, so yeah, I figured I'd do one today. Um, also, um, in the last episode of FanDuel Nothing to Riches, I told you that I won at least a 25 cent entry in a contest for the NBA. And yeah, I ended up winning a $1 entry. So we add 75 cents to the total of $1. And unfortunately, I did not win anything in said dollar contest, so we go back down to zero. However, there was a contest that I had entered since then where I won 35 cents in cash. Add that to the ticker. Now I'm going to show you the contest that I entered in which I won the 35 cents. This damn thing can go. There we go. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Uh, where is it? I finished in 35th place, but there was like a thousand, maybe 1100 way tie. Found it. Yeah, see, here's the lineup I used. I used. Joel Embiid as my MVP, he ended up scoring 72.45. Without the MVP bonus, he would have only scored 48.3. JJ Redick, who scored 32.6. Robert Covington, who scored 47.8. Now this is for the Philadelphia 76ers against the Boston Celtics. Now I only picked two Celtics. I could have picked all 76ers. But I didn't want to, even though I'm a Knicks fan. So yeah. Uh, the Celtics I picked were Terry Rozier at 47.9 and Jason Tatum at oh Tatum, I'm sorry, I said Tantum at 30.4. In all, that's a total of 231.15. Not enough to get into first place, but enough to get me to win a prize. So yeah. And I'm going to use that, um, scratch that, I already used 25 cents of that, so we subtract that from the ticker, to enter into an NBA contest for a quarter. Wait, that was kind of redundant, derp. Um, I'm also using this lineup in the free contest that they're doing throughout the playoffs. Here's who I used. This is going to be for Toronto against Cleveland. I use LeBron James. Oh, scratch, I am using LeBron James. What is wrong with me today? As my MVP. J.R. Smith as the guard. And Jay Green. I don't know what his name is. Let me check. Jeff Green, okay. Sergei, Sergei Ibaka for Toronto and Kyle Korver for Cleveland. Wait a minute. I really should have picked another um, Toronto player. The Raptors. So, yeah. That's the lineup I'm using in the 25 cent $50 small free, fade away. Free away. What the hell? Everybody gets paid. But you could end up with less money than you spent. Normally I'd stay away from these contests. This is the only five-man contest in which it costs a quarter to enter. And there are no 35-cent contests, so yeah. And I also entered the Home Run Challenge. I haven't had much luck in the past couple weeks with the Home Run Challenge. But I picked Bryce Harper and Matt Adams for Washington. And Javier Baez for the Chicago Cubs. And those cheap bastards at FanDuel decided to lower the prize pool to $200. Then again, I understand because now if you win, you get an entry into the $100,000 home run challenge contest on September 14th. Even though that's five months away. Oh, I'm sorry, four months away, derp. Here I am thinking it's April. Um, I think. It'll be worth it. That long wait. It probably won't be a long wait if I win really late or not at all. 
But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Remember to subscribe for guaranteed videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday, 5 p.m. Eastern to Pacific. And if you want to get in on the action, you can use my referral link, deposit 20 bucks, and we each get 10. Well, you have to use that 20 bucks, but still. And please play responsibly. If you some of you know is a gambling problem, call the number in the description box below, or visit the link in the description box below. Not my referral link. There's going to be another link in the description box below. Visit that if you or someone you know has a gambling problem. And I will let you know the results in the next episode of FanDuel Nothing to Riches. So if that's everything that I needed to say. Oh, yes. Um, this week I will be doing a surprise video because um, I forgot that my last video went up on Cinco de Mayo. And I forgot to wish you guys a happy Cinco de Mayo. But whatever. I ended up being the CFO in Toontown Written anyway. <laughs> With help us have another tunes, but you know what I mean. I will see you all on Wednesday. Bye.